Hi everyone, meteorologist Anthony Baglione here in the WRAL Severe Weather Center. I hope you've had a great week so far. We're getting ready to head into, of course, the holiday weekend. And so the big question is, how does the forecast shape up? We are certainly going to see just a sweltering a couple of days, both Sunday and especially into Monday, and then even continuing into July 4th. Feels like temperatures start to go up into tomorrow. We're going to be feeling like 102 on Saturday, near 110 on Sunday. Sunday and Monday, I do think we will likely see heat advisories come out. So just keep that in mind. Otherwise, no major issues for us. Here's where we're headed today. We're going to see high temperatures near 92 this afternoon. Should see lots of sunshine, maybe a little bit of haze early on. And then we'll just continue with a few clouds and it's going to be a warm forecast, a little bit humid. Otherwise, really actually not too bad here before the heat really builds this weekend. Here's what we're looking at future cast wise. So today we're looking good tomorrow and Saturday, though. Those are going to be weather alert days. We do have the chance for some strong to severe storms. So let's walk through future cast. You see today looking good. Future cast is trying to sneak up maybe a spotty shower this afternoon. I think most of us are going to be nice and dry. That's just picking up on the sea breeze east of us. There's eight o'clock tomorrow morning. We head through our Friday. Most of the day tomorrow is looking pretty dry. There's five o'clock. We may see a few passing light showers tomorrow afternoon, maybe a thunderstorm. The best chance, though, for any storms strong to severe wise would be tomorrow evening, let's say 8 to 11 p.m. or so. This line should be weakening, though, as it gets into our neighborhood. So I'm not anticipating widespread severe weather. But again, during the day on Saturday, it's going to be a very similar forecast where we have this level one in place for the triangle into the west. And then that continues again on Saturday here. There's the level one for Saturday. This is not going to be a widespread severe event. It's just there's a line coming in from up in the Ohio and Tennessee valleys that could maintain a little bit of strength as it gets closer to us. We're going to have to watch to see kind of what it does, but I'd still stay weather aware for tomorrow evening and Saturday evening. Otherwise, July 4th, 95 degrees, hot and humid. We could see a few hit or miss storms. We'll have to see kind of fireworks time frame if they affect that. It will not be a washout, but I do think we could see a few around the evening hours. Otherwise, we're at 92 today, 91 tomorrow, 93 for our Saturday, 98 degrees on Sunday, 97 Monday. It is going to be a potentially dangerously hot weekend, so just make sure to stay hydrated, especially if you're headed out for any of those July 4th plans. Otherwise, you're looking pretty good here the next little while.